In this video, we're going to work out the equation of this line of best fit. So what we need to do is to work out the gradient of this line and then its y-intercept. So to work out the gradient, remember we had the formula, m is equal to y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So we need to find two points of this line. Now, it does not have to be one of the points, the data points on this scatter graph. It's much better to pick points so make it whole numbers. So this point here, this one, is the point 3, 5. So I'm going to use that one. And then I'm also going to use this one here. And that is 1, 3. So there's my two data points. So um, let's work that out. Y2, well that's Y2 there, that's 5. Minus Y1 is 3, so it's over there. Uh, X2 is 3 minus... Uh, x1 is 1. So 5 take away 3 is 2. 3 take away 2 is 2. So the answer is 1. So my gradient is 1. So I've got the, my uh, equation of the straight line. It's y equals mx plus c. Put in my gradient of 1, we get y is equal to x plus c. Now if you remember, we sub in a point that we know to find c. So I'm going to sub in... Uh, 1, 3. So this means that the y coordinate becomes, uh, y value becomes 3, that's my y coordinate. x becomes the x coordinate, that's 1 plus c. So taking away 1 from both sides, we get c equals 2. So the equation of this straight line then is going to be y equals x plus 2. Now, y and x are not the values of the axes, that's L and F, so I need to replace L, uh, Y with L and X with F. So my formula is L equals F plus 2. 